Hey Raven fam, welcome to another episode of the Tale of Bastoon. I want to thank Muhammad for uh, giving me the heads up on how to pronounce it, and I might still be butchering it, and if I am, I apologize Muhammad, I, I truly tried. Um, but normally on my videos, I've been recently been getting maybe 8, 9, 10 views on most videos. Um, I posted the, the first gameplay for this, uh, which was actually from a demo. And I got like a hundred some views and I ended up getting like 10 likes. So I, I did mention in the first video that if I got at least four likes, I would do a full uh, series on this. So that, that's the plan. I'm going to do a full series. Um, and I just want to say thank you to everyone that takes time out of their day to watch these videos. I mean, we have like eight or nine like solid, you're faithful. And I don't know who, who you are exactly uh, because I can't always see who my uh, subscribers are. Um, but I just want to say thank you. It, it really, it truly means a lot. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's check this game out. Oh, and before I forget, I love you, CJ and AJ. Um, but yeah, let's continue our journey. And I don't know if I'll end up renaming this. Uh, maybe number one, and the other one I'll change to a demo. It all depends on how much difference there is. Because I know normally when they re release a demo, um, for the most part, they don't usually start you off necessarily at the beginning of the game. It's usually like some later on in in, in your adventures. They don't want you to see the very beginning. I guess maybe they're scared it might suck. I don't know. I really don't know. Put you right in the action, you know? Anyways, I'm gonna stop babbling because that's what I do out of my mouth hole. But I love you guys, and yeah, let's check this game out. I'm kind of curious to see if this does start off different. It does start off different. I don't remember going through the nebulae. Nebula. However you pronounce it. It doesn't really matter. Context is everything. It kind of looks like Bart Simpson from the side there. Just saying. Bart, is that you? transformed into something spectacular this guy just ate some bad sushi probably has a little stomach ache I think that's where his heart is though he might be dying maybe not if he is he'll come back because he's the main character before we are forgotten we will be turned into quiche quiche is the stop over between being and oblivion I think I butchered that I don't think that's how you pronounce that slowly like the morning sun clambering over the horizon, consciousness came. He opened his eyes. All right, so wake up, my friend. He's got like feathers coming out. I don't know if that's feathers. It might be. All right, so How pleasant, he thought, to wake to nature's song. But something was not right. The song was out of tune. All right, so we had axes in the in the demo, but we don't have axes yet. So this is definitely something As different. He navigated the narrow paths. He breathed in the fresh mountain air. It focused his mind. Questions bobbed to the surface, like apples in water. How did I come to be here? He asked himself. No, that's not the right question nor is where I'm going. A single terrible realization crystallized in his fogged mind. I don't know who I am. Many stories have been told about poor souls who have forgotten the paths they have trodden. But there is more to this tale. That I promise. So this game looks phenomenal. Um, I wouldn't say it's like the current gen graphic the standard, glow but of the man's lantern fell on <clears throat> an exotic bird, a hoopoe. The recognition Hoopo. heartened him. Perhaps the bird would lead to further revelations. He followed the hoopoe on instinct. Its beautiful trail fanned the flame of hope. So we're gonna name him Hoopy. He spotted something glinting among the rocks. Oh, there's our axes. That called to him. Alright, so this game is phenomenal, guys. I have uh, really enjoyed it. All he did was pull that hatchet out of the stone. It was lace, A buddy. Act there was stuff on the handle. Remarkable outcome. You're lucky to be alive. The revelation. There was no way back. What no way back, they say. This place was. He had to push on. 
The weight of the hatchets in his hands brought some comfort as he journeyed deeper. All right, so let's go ahead and start using these axes that we got. Help me. Now we're hearing voices. Who's there? The man called. Larry. His voice muffled by the thick, static air. Please help. Where are you? No answer came. I'm gonna have to say. The man felt despair. The kind that only the truly alone know. But he was mistaken. There was another in this ethereal place. The tree was alive, but bound tight by otherworldly rocks and glowing tentacles. The blades of the man's hatchets were sharp. All right, so I love the color palette they use for this game. I'm sorry, I'm just looking around. I'm the collector, so I always like to walk around and see if there's anything just sitting around. The we're going to free this tree, I believe. The creature were friend or foe, but he felt its pain and fear. It mirrored his own. I think he might just be gassy. wise, the man did not know, but empathy overrode his rational misgivings. Me and Hoopy are going to save this tree. It's going to happen. Now, I remember him having like some crazy red eyes uh, in the demo, so I'm assuming he's still going to look demonic. Maybe not. You never know. He might have changed his ways. Maybe he'll have like dark green eyes. Nope, they're red. Definitely red. There's definitely a demon in there. Creature freed. The man approached. Oh, look, he's giving us a hug. Buddy, don't put your hand there. No means no. I love that, that image of that dragon. It's pretty sick. I wonder if we'll actually eventually run into some dragons. What happened? The man cried. Where have you taken me? To hell, buddy. Calm yourself, human. Gonna open up his chest cavity. Not want to leave that alien realm. The tree leaned closer and introduced himself as all seeds. A pomegranate tree. I I don't know who I am, the man said. All seeds pondered. Others like me have been afflicted by a sickness. Help them. And I will return the favor. All seeds told the man to look for talisman stones. Strange rocks protruding from the ground. Destroying the talisman stones would free his kind. Then, the mighty tree extended a great branch outwards, pointing east. Unearth the Kanat Gate to find the path forward. Find yourself. I'm going to give you a heads up. There's a lot of narration in this game, so I'm going to get cut off as I'm speaking words out of my mouth hole. It just happens. I want to go back here real quick. Can we go over here? No, there, I, was th I was thinking there might be like a little secret passage. I probably did the same thing on the demo, too. You can't fix stupid, guys. You can't fix stupid. All right, let me go over here. And break this wall down with my awesome axe. Nice. Yeah, I love these little still images. The color and everything are. You guys chose an awesome palette. The man could roll under low objects with ease. All right, so we just gotta roll under this tree. That should be an easy thing to That's do, Ryan. Man. The man mulled all seeds' words. How will rescuing the tree's kin help me recover my memory? He wondered. Well, nobody knows, buddy. We're going to find out as we go through our adventure. If travel broadens the mind, I should be wise beyond compare. 
I have traversed mountains, braved jungles, and trudged through deserts. But all journeys must come to an end. Perhaps Mount Bistoon, Bistoon, sorry Muhammad, will be the place I settle, where I build my abode. Is it suitable? After all, wisdom is knowing how little we know. It appears so to be a diary entry engraved into the stone. But to whom it belonged was a mystery. Albert Einstein. Pretty sure that's who that was. I'm not being serious. As he trod the winding path, the man thought about everything that had befallen him. He worried about the nature of the sickness that all seeds had spoken of. How extensive was it? And how would it manifest itself? Little did he know that the answer to the latter question would begin to reveal itself a few you are invincible to all damages while you are rolling by pressing a Two steps further well that's good to know oh no forgot about these goblin guys it's larry curly where's mo come on mo I, there you are it's mo jr there's frank why, why weren't you at work yesterday frank Alright, this, I love the way this, it, it kind of feels like Lord of the Rings, I'm sorry. I keep thinking these guys are orcs. Can't help it. Alright, I think we just have to break this if I remember correctly. Alright, open up the gate. Actually, I remember there being, each diamond represents one of the trees you have freed from the sickness. This must be one of all seeds trees. The man thought. I thought there was something over here. Hard after I was wrong. <sighs> The definitely won't be my last time doing that. It's vibrant leaves, embracing all but forgotten sunshine. What were those nasty little creatures? The man thought. Are they tainted by this sickness or harbingers of it? I don't know, buddy. I don't know. Maybe both. I'm going to go with both. Oh, more goblins. I see you guys over here hiding in your little pink st or purple stones. Oh, nice. We got five for one deal here. I don't think I've played and gotten hit yet, but now that I say that, that's when I'm going to get hit. This game has a very relaxed vibe to it. Like, I don't feel like anxious or like I'm going to die or anything. It's just a nice, relaxed, mellow time. Hello, Mr. Goblins. You want to come over and have some brunch? All right, this is what I was thinking about. All these vases over here. Plus, I think there's one of those tablets over here. All the trap trees are rescued in this area. Explore more to find the hidden items or find a new quantic gate to return. I As will try my hardest. Was released. Night passed its way over the, land. the inevitability of dusk. The serene quiet of it brought the man a sense of peace. It seems I chose poorly. Mount Bastoon appeared welcoming, but I have discovered strange hostile creatures living here. They are small and easily dispatched, but there's a chilling hunger in their eyes, a sort of greed that can never be satisfied. Whoever engraved this may know more about those creatures, he thought. Well, isn't that smart of you, my friend? I think I could have sworn we had another one we had to set free. Maybe, maybe not. Very forgetful. Come on, Hoopy. Lead me out of this place of... I don't even know what to call it. It actually looks pretty pleasant. Other than the, the goblins that run around on a daily basis. Trying to kill you so they can eat your soul. Hoopy, can you teach me how to fly? That would be phenomenal. All Seeds was right. There is a sickness afflicting nature. The talisman stones must be at the heart of it. But where did they come from? Were those swarming creatures defending them? So many questions. So few answers. And still, he didn't know who he was. It's a shame this guy doesn't know about Google. The most 100% trusted resource for accurate news. There's our dragon friend. We need to come up with a name with him as well. I think we'll call him Spike. Go on, Spike. 
Go into the ground. All seeds was asleep. A huge pomegranate hung from a branch. Oh, we gotta get this pomegranate. Can I not get it? Oh, there we go. You gotta be inside the circle, Ryan. Go ahead, take a little nibble. Don't worry. It's nothing wrong with it. You're gonna feel a slight pain in your chest and mainly in your head. It's not a stroke. It's not- you're not stroking out, buddy. You're just tripping. You're welcome. Didn't charge you for anything. First hit's free, buddy. Second one's not. Dude tripping out. But he ate too much pomegranate. The mountain for heart. You must dig. That is a woman. I need you here. Yeah, this dude is having a good time. You just broke her in half. What kind of creature? I'm sorry, buddy. The tentacles took her. She'll never be seen again. Not breathing anyway. Alright, so we can't talk to him. When the icon is beating, it's time to dig into the mountain. Ooh, dig into the mountain, you say. My name is Farhad. But who was that pain woman? And why did she ask what she did? Buddy, I don't know. All I know is you're pretty strong. Your axes. I remember now. My name is Farhad. Such solace in something so simple as a name. But still, that is all I recall. Who was that woman? Why does she want me to dig into the mountainside? Because she's the devil. And they put a spell on her. And she wants to be freed. Facade, Farhad, whatever your name is. Larry. You know Larry. Does she want amethystine stones? Farhad wondered. I'm sure she just wants your soul. Nothing, no biggie, you know? Suck the life right out of you. Look at old Whoopi. He is just chilling. While we're glowing. It's not a real friend. He has not once has he asked, are we okay? I'm just saying. Farhad found himself in the Celestial Revelations realm once more. Alright fam, I think this is a good stopping point. I uh, really appreciate you guys hanging out and watching the video. Uh, thank you guys again for all of your support. It's, it is amazing. Uh, I truly love you guys, and I know that you guys take time out of your day, which most of us don't have a lot of time, let's be honest. Uh, but you do take time and check these videos out, and I just want you to know that I truly, greatly appreciate it. But uh, yeah, until next time.